ladies and gentlemen, I say, imagining that there's ladies in my audience. I see you, you 12% of my viewers. We are here today with another Nux reaction on the Discord. Discord.gg slash Billy gets you in here. Nux react. It's a good time. You will not make me laugh. If you do make me laugh, you become an elite, Billy. Your name will be in gold for all to see. So, let's go. Let's see. Are you actually going to make me laugh? Well, I'll tell you one thing. The Billies will not succeed. Cosmo is based. Oh, yeah! Well, well, you know what I think! Who cares what you think? You're a girl now! <laughs> oh, my God! Can we just respect that, uh, as far as character writing goes, Cosmo has been a misogynist for the entirety of the show. Okay, let me find this other clip that I was thinking of. Uh, hi, dads. What are you doing here? We've come for the creature you call mom. No, you have a perfect civilization. Why would you want to add a woman to it? Dog. <laughs> I don't understand. Why would you add a woman? <laughs> is... uh, okay. Uh... This is the best sign I've ever seen. I didn't laugh, but this sign is the best scene of all time. This sign is a sign that signs should look up to for civilizations. I'm not getting copyrighted, we keep going. The dumbest TikTok trends to ever fucking exist. The Benadryl challenge was a challenge where people would basically take no. a shit ton of Benadryl. There's now no way that's real. Now, why were they doing this? Because apparently it would cause hallucinations. But you know what else taking a shit ton of Benadryl causes? Death. Fucking death. Which is exactly- Look, that's just a side effect, okay? It's death is just a side effect of overdosing, okay? What happened to a young girl who did this challenge? The blackout challenge, aka the choke game, was a challenge where people would basically make themselves stop breathing so that they would pass out unconscious. I'm not making this up, this was a real thing. It didn't directly start on TikTok, but this trend made it more popular on the app. And so started on Pornhub. I that's where it started. Then TikTok kids were like, hey, we can take all that sexy part out of this. Surprise, surprise, seven kids died trying to do this challenge. Oh the my god! Dude, TikTok is like an actual, like, invasion strategy. It's like an, the Chinese invasion started already. We just don't know about it. Cha-Cha Slide Challenge was a challenge where people would film themselves driving to the Cha-Cha Slide. Whenever the song went to the left or to the right, you would basically swerve your car in that direction. Oh and hella Lord. people would just straight up swerve right in the middle of traffic. The amount of dumbasses that got into a car accident doing this challenge is insane. No way Penny Challenge was a challenge where people would put a coin on the prongs of a phone oh charger as it was still plugged into an outlet. Now the point of doing this was to try and get a little shock but in case you didn't know that causes the outlet to fucking explode and can set your goddamn house on fire and some kids were dumb enough to bro darwin knew what's up darwin was like bro we're not having wars anymore where people are like on foot like now all wars have like nukes involved and it's like it's too high risk high reward tiktok though tiktok is darwin's newest <laughs> anyway to do this in their school. In March 2020, people started the coronavirus challenge where they would try to get COVID oh, by I licking the most this. random oh, shit. Lord. Doorknobs, handrails, toilet seats. Nothing was off limits for these fuckers. And yes, it worked. People got COVID from this. It also- You don't say. Woman arrested driving a kid's Tonka truck on the road. What's going on, America? This is Kevin from Kevin's Corner where I hey, try Kevin to make sense Kevin's out of Corner. nonsense. And what doesn't make sense is why a grown lady got arrested driving down the street in a kid's powered Tonka truck. You know those little ones, kids being, and she looked like she was driving a clown car. It was hilarious. And I'm thinking if I was the officer, why arrest her? When you can use this moment to have unlimited laughter. I would have just oh. pulled her over and asked some questions. Unlimited like, laughter, Excuse you me, say? man, where you headed? Well, I needed to get some groceries. Are you aware that you're riding in a kid's Tonka truck? Yes, I am. Okay, all right, do you have enough power to get to the grocery store in this truck and get back? What if the power runs out? Well, you know, I didn't think about that. I just need some cigarettes and all that stuff. Okay, ma'am, do you have a license to, uh, to drive this little toy? All right, we keep going. Jacksepticeye laugh song. L is for lovers who love one another. A is for ass, of which I like to eat. 
Sweet. U is for okay. you're the only one for me. G is for the only gamer I see. And H is for happy. I always feel it when you put them together. What do you get? Laugh! Hello, everyone! If Jacksepticeye copyrights me, I will quit my job and start working in a mine. Okay? If I'm sing this this terror laugh is the thing that I have between my legs, and then I get copyrighted, I will literally come. You have one new message. Hey, this is Phil from the Small Wiener Club. Uh, sorry to get back to you so late. I just finished reviewing Ooh. your application and information Ooh. you sent in. Uh, but I am oh. sorry to say that I don't think I can allow you to join our oh. group. From what I'm looking at, your wiener is massive. I mean, the sheer girth and juiciness okay. alone I'm, is I'm, ridiculous. No laugh. No laugh. Uh, I'm not gonna uh, laugh. It looks as I'm if somebody glued laugh. a forearm to the bottom of your torso. You could probably stand on it like a tripod. Oh uh, and that's not even mentioning how fat your nuts are. No, no, uh, no, no, but no, no, it does no, no. appear that you're going to have to take that ginormous schmear uh somewhere else but thank you for trying and best of luck to you lord the flex the flex yo hey buddy uh i got some turpentine some wax and some high gloss boat paint this shit is really expensive oh dude yeah you're telling me i picked us up some new slacks and dock siders so we could have the right look you know and fit in and everything we're running pretty low on remaining dictile money, though. Guess we gotta fill that thing up with gas. No, and... man, we gotta pop by the department store, pick up the mattress. And I'm gonna yeah. get a nice one, too. You know what I'm saying? The, the, the what? The mattress? What do we need a mattress for? What do you mean, what do we need a mattress for? Why in the hell do you think we just spent all that money on a boat? The whole purpose of buying the boat in the first place was to get the ladies nice and tipsy topside so we can take them to a nice, comfortable place below deck and... All right, that one didn't make me laugh. We keep going. <laughs> You didn't get it, Chet. Oh, you didn't get it, Chet. Oh, this makes me cry. This makes me cry. <laughs> God damn it. No, I, I just didn't expect the monkey to slap the lion back. God damn it. All right. Like, subscribe, and follow me on Twitch. Stay weird, fam.